what's up, guys? So consider joining our locals. If you like the fact that we catch predators nationwide, it's not possible without you joining our locals. On locals, you get to see over 20 catches early, completely uncensored. You get to see live predator confrontations as they happen. And you get to support the movement that has an arrest in 43 different states and convictions in 24. We do travel the most and catch the sickest. It's only $7 a month. You get more early content than Rumble. We do big content dumps every single month on locals. And can't do this without you guys. Consider joining locals. Here we go. Oh, appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I love your jacket too. Oh yeah, I made this. Oh. No shit, you made that yourself? Uh-huh, you see some of the other ones I got. What is that, Venom? Yeah. Okay. Cool, this, cool. This used to be a solid shirt. Really? I just, like, cut it all up. Yeah, I found it in the trash. Oh, hell yeah. These, and then uh, this is all trash. Like half this is chicks clothes, actually. Uh-huh, Yeah. This awesome is, like, shit. It, all right, cool. Oh, okay. Oh, hey. What's your, what's your name, by the way? I'm Connor. Gordon, nice to meet you. Gordon? Yes. I got to talk to you about uh, Summer. Oh. Okay. Um, I think we should probably just go talk over there, kind of a little bit about it, if you don't mind. Yeah. <laughs> Movie doesn't start until 955, though, right? Okay, cool. So we've got some time, then. Okay. Cool. All right. Mind up coming over here? All right. Yeah. There, there's a there's a cop, so I'll just kind of be quiet. Just We'll talk over there. Cool? Okay. All right. Uh, I got a two people with me for safety, but we're not going to hurt you or anything like that. We're just going to, you know, the movie starts at 9.55, so you might as well just have a word here, you know what I'm saying? All right, cool. So. I'm a landscaper. Well, thank you for what you do. I'm glad you work hard. Uh, yeah, I'm in a much better place than I used to be. Really? Uh, I don't know, man. I, I've been through all kinds of craziness and stuff, and I uh -huh. don't really like it. Got it. Oh, uh, maybe we shouldn't know. be uh, here. You just want to kind of go to the other end of the parking lot or kind of a... Uh, yeah. I just... I don't know. I have any friends. With but, Summer. Yeah. Got it. That makes sense. No, she kept asking about this too and I felt horrible. So I just like warned her about like the awful truth about it or like why no one should ever, ever, ever touch this stuff. For sure. So, I mean, how old is she? Uh, she told me she was 13. Okay. So just kind of a... Uh, just kind of making sure she's in the right place. All right, where are the messages? That's actually why I freaking... Uh, can you go get the messages? All right. You, that's why you're what? That's why I actually like and met, emailed police officers. I'm more worried about, like she wanted to meet and I was more worried about her safety than anything else. Okay. Cool, cool. Yeah, cause you know, obviously, you know what I'm here to talk to you about and stuff, right? Okay. So, I mean, you mentioned like you're kind of lonely, you're living in like the halfway house and stuff. How, yeah. how long have you been in the halfway house? 17 months. Really? Mm -hmm. And that was for kind of, I don't care, but stuff. My, uh, my landlord freaking, uh, he stole my stimulus checks, my wallet, and my he, medical license. They beat me up and threw me out of the house. He did? And I found bodies in the basement. And I've been telling people for a long time. Uh-huh. And they just, they stole my son's dog. And I just. Oh, man. I, I got a bunch of CDS charges for my medical license. Mm -hmm. And I just. Hard. I, I had once. And I just, I don't know. Hard life. I, some of it was my fault. But I mean, I, I guess I'd learn the hard way. But I had, I had my license. And the judge didn't even believe me, man. Mm. I, a license yeah okay and i i mean they made it impossible for me to get to get anything done or to just yeah all right well hey so you've kind of been through a lot huh yeah i'm not trying to make anyone else's problems i just want to like actually hey man sh sh shit happens for sure you said plan a future yeah okay is that kind of what this was trying to maybe build a future with somebody i mean i was gonna take it slowly sure 
okay. So, I mean, that, that's kind of, because, you know, there's people online that are very just overbearing and you, is kind of, it was kind of what you wanted just to see where this goes with Summer? Yeah. Okay. Where did, where did you want it to go? If she was willing, of course. I mean, that's up to her, but I... Like, I even, told, to, even to marry I told her? her what, I mean, yeah. Okay. That's kind of, that's why I said we need to pray about first, too. And I told her, like, anything, because she kept asking me what I want to do, and I told her that doesn't matter. Sure. Anything compared to what she wants, that what I want is irrelevant. Okay. So, if she wanted to get married and just kind of live that beautiful life with you, that would be her, her deal and kind of, that would just yeah. kind of be her, her, her up to her? I mean, I want to. Okay. That's not something I would dismiss, but I mean, it's that's not entirely my say, is it? Sure. So it takes two, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, so you're not here to like do anything evil. You're just here to just. No. Okay. You're just here. You'd basically see where this goes. Yeah, that's another reason I picked like public thingy. Absolutely. Okay. Cool, man. I I, I really respect the hell out of that. Um, so obviously the messages were, uh, you know, very cordial. I mean, it seemed like you guys really cared a lot about each other. Um, I think. Got a big old thing. It's been since what January? Wow. Okay. So I think it was to Facebook to a phone number. Yeah. Did y'all talk on Telegram at all? Huh? Did y'all talk on Telegram at all? Telegram. Yeah. No. Okay. Do you have Telegram at all? What's that? Okay. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, just a lot of stuff. So you showed her a lot of uh, stuff at your job. Like, oh, you did the Gorlock the Destroyer meme. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. So do you watch that podcast or do you just kind of have a Twitter? No, I just saw it on Facebook and I thought somebody's being, I don't know, I just laughed way harder than I should have. I, I did too. Gorlock the Destroyer. It's one yeah. of my favorite memes. Did you actually watch that clip though? Uh-uh. Oh, no, it, I just, I've seen a bunch of meme posts about it. And she, she swears she's a 10 out of 10. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> she also wants, oh my God, you said she wants somebody with the ring and 500k income. Yeah. For a ring. <laughs> 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 yeah so with summer i mean geez louise i mean hey with girls like gorlock the destroyer i can't blame, blame you for going after you know dating summer and shit you know she seems like an actual nice person humble and all that were there any like selfies exchanged between you guys yeah okay like she would send some you'd send some yeah okay was there like a uh, a picture of, of like parts exchanged I just asked her, and she said, since you asked, and you're nice. Okay. Uh, I mean, we were talking about it on the phone. Okay. She said she wanted to do that. Okay. So, she got a picture of, like, how many, how many, was it a, a multiple pics did you send her, or just one? Yeah, or? a couple. But, I mean, I asked her first. If we were talking about it on the phone, and that's why I just... Okay. For sure. So, it was kind of, you were just waiting for her to be ready for that stuff? I mean, it's... I don't... I'm not going to push it on somebody, but, like, since it conversation kind of went that way. Absolutely. Okay. So, it was very, yeah, I mean, when you said you want to take it slow, I mean, you really... Yeah, I kind of dropped the ball there. Well, no, no, I mean, I think you really did take it slow, and eventually, as all things, it progressed, and shit, shit what happened. So, you're learning Spanish. Mm -hmm. Why? You're, you're here. My, my boss is Hispanic. Okay, cool. Um, how's they that just, coming along? Well, I mean, they, I mean, it's not a bad company, and they, they, uh, okay, so, like, um, half his crew members don't speak English. Or okay. There's like miscommunication between people or customers. Yeah, so yeah. I just, I try and, I don't know, I'm learning too, but like, I mean, sometimes it's just like, you know, that we have to get by with like crude, like, so, like, okay, the guy will tell me, like, Ugh. and show me how to do something. Uh huh. And then other times, like, I mean, I got to the point where I can, like, issue, what's the word, primitive directions in Spanish. Oh, shit, sure. like, I, uh. Like, okay, so, yo necesito una pala y la tierra. Necesito esta aquí. Like I can tell him I need a shovel and that the uh, the dirt needs to go over there. Nice. Or piedra is another one. Nice. Oh, it's for safety, just so you can okay. be sure we're not going to hurt you or anything like that. That's actually why I messaged your email, uh, Lynn Hamlin, because I don't want anyone like thinking I'm doing something weird. Who's that? And I, uh, Officer Lynn Hamlin from the Skokie PD. Okay. I just messaged him first and let him know like where we were and what movie showing. Because mm -hmm. I I don't I just more worried about her safety. Absolutely. Before she falls into the hands of like the wrong guy or something like that. Okay. Dang. So, I mean, did you want to ever teach her Spanish? That would be cool. She wants to start learning German. I'm kind of behind on my lessons with that one because I've got to focus on workload and Spanish. But I so, just... so she's she's a d that wants to learn German. Yeah, I know. I kind of I point that out. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's that's something, isn't it? I know. I mean, just 
people are people, you know. I mean, Absolutely, I for sure. Judge life is life is really different. Absolutely, man. So, I mean, obviously, I mean, and you have some pet cats and stuff like that. Yeah, they're not the ones I initially had, but I mean, they're kind of there, and I just bonded with them. I didn't mm. want to, but now I did. Nice. Kind of look like a from Shrek put Puss in Boots. Well, you're the Puss in Boots, you know. Or you know who that is, like the cat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Um, I haven't seen the newest one yet, but they've got. I've watched one too, like a couple of times. Mm -hmm. Okay, so obviously, you know, eventually the messages escalated because I guess it was a relationship. I mean, were you guys boyfriend and girlfriend, or are you guys boyfriend and girlfriend? I mean, I don't know, we talked about that, but okay. we weren't, like, officially or anything. So okay. She said she wanted to meet, so I was like, okay. Got it. So, obviously, with, you know, just seeing how far it could go, I guess that would be the step towards marriage, right? I mean, that's the first step. Right. I mean, I don't want to rush into things. You're just like, boom, commitment. Absolutely. Like, just seeing, you know, I kind of wanted to see where everybody was. Okay, that's very respectable. So, um, was she just kind of cute to you in a way? Yeah. That's fair. Um, so you're so gorgeous. She says no. And you said, ooh, I'd kiss the ever-living, ever-loving F out of you. Yeesh. It's kind of how I talk to my girlfriend. And you said, you've never, like, tried that stuff, though. I would cherish you regardless, Miss Summer. So there was also a message, of course, uh, and, of course, the phone calls, too, were, I think, where most of the, the racy stuff was said. I guess you could call it that. Um, so also a message saying... I don't want to break your heart, but I want to break your Yeah, I have no excuse for that. Okay. Well, I mean, obviously, you know, there's tons of ways that can happen, right? It could be against her will. It could be... No. Yeah, they, I mean, there's obviously better situations than other ones. You know what I'm saying? Like, it could be... You know, I don't think that is... Like, I wouldn't be talking to you if I thought it was going to be that situation. You know what I mean? So I want to ask, like, when it comes to breaking her heart, as in, it's a pretty uh, rough way to say have sex, I think, or whatever. I mean, Asking about it, I, just, I mean, I'm not dismissing that I would, I'm not interested, but I mean, that that's why when she keeps saying, what do you want to do? I said, that doesn't matter. It's okay. It's up to what you want to do. So would kind of that only, this only happen if she was cool with it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, hey man, I really appreciate that. So basically the only way you'd have sex with her anytime soon is if she's okay with it. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, thank you so much. I really appreciate your honesty. And no, I appreciate I actually, so I've been telling the police about this too. There's really bad stuff happening in the motel on 32nd. What's happening? I've, they're killing people and forcing people. Uh -huh. I found. It's okay. You're good. Go ahead. You're good. I'm not, so, you? I'm not even kidding. I've, no, I believe I've you. What, what happened? They keep killing people in there. Mm -hmm. I. I started trying to the people doing it. Mm -hmm. Has it been traumatizing you? So many was coming up. And I keep telling people it's happening and they just laugh at me or say I waste all this dope and they just I've been jumped because they keep saying I'm a snitch. Oh. Man, I'm sorry, man. I, I was using these ambient noise amplifiers to hear it. And how did you hear them? Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, man. Is that near Ray's? No. No, but there's a lot of really bad stuff there, too. Okay. I recorded some of it and sent it to the cops. Okay. What did the cops say? I, they haven't sent me a single thing back, and I kind of oh. agree that it's not... Like, that they're covering it up? I don't know. Dude, I, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm not from here. I'm from Tulsa, so I don't know what's going down here, man. I'm, I'm really sorry that... She... I, I detest that. Oh, it happened to me before, and I... I would beat people with 20 millimeter socket bits on paracord. You're going to beat me with that, right? No. Okay, no. okay. Unless you're forcing someone. No, well, I'm not, so... Got I it. I don't just use them on anyone. They leave 50 cent well pieces mm -hmm. and they break ribs oh god well i hope uh we got a lot to go before we get my ribs so um I'm, it's not for you okay yeah no no i know i, I don't even you. have they stole a bunch of them but i i mean you're just like 
from behind. Mm -hmm. Got it, man. So you've seen a lot in your life, huh? I mean, I don't think there's anyone who hasn't or been through something. I sure. Just... There's, there's degrees, right? I mean, kind of like with stuff like this, there's degrees to it. I mean, um, how was your childhood? You know, I... it, it's had its moments. I mean, everything has its ups and downs, but it, I, I guess I didn't really, I realized I didn't really have one for a while, or I had, I have to watch my brothers sometimes while my mom's at work, or I don't know what she was doing. My parents got divorced and fight a lot. Was there ever any like physical towards you? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I just, I don't want to deal with that sort of stuff. I just want to love. I know. And I, they, my ex threw my son in a car and sped off on Christmas Eve. Mm -hmm. And I've got to speak a word to her from him since. Aww. And then they stole and sold his dog. And I just, it all kept just. And I just. How old's your son? He's going to be eight, seven. When's the last time you seen When's the last time you've seen him? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you miss him? I feel you. Do you have like a way to contact him? Or? She, I, she keeps blocking me. Oh man, I'm sorry, dude. Been through what? some shit. Well, hey man, I'm not. What hurts the worst is it? Here for you, bro. I can't even just like stop anymore. Everyone used to make fun of me or keep hitting me. I'm not here to do that. I'm not here to judge you, dude. Truly, I, do you mind if I sit here? Go for it. All right. Really not here to judge you for anything, man. All right, look, I mean, I appreciate your perspective. I really appreciate like your perspective, man. I mean, a lot of shit's happened to you. And the fact that you're even sitting here says a lot about your character, I think, truly. I'm proud of you, man. I don't know you that well. I just, you know, I'm, I know you as Connor, right? You know me as Gordon. I'm proud of you though, truly. So let's get over this hurdle, shall we? Mm -hmm. Let's do it. With me? Yeah. All right, let's be together on this, all right? So, obviously in the, in the movie theater, and again, I mean, after you described what was going on there and uh, in the, the motel, <laughs> not even remotely close to what was gonna happen in there, but, you know, there's talk about basically. I mean, it, she invites, I'm not, I don't know. I, I was kind of just gonna try and keep PG-13 as long as possible or sure. like, you know. Basically. I mean, I'm not saying I wouldn't, but I wouldn't refuse her, but I mean. Basically, if she wanted to kind of like, you know, do the, 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 or the, the, I mean, that would be up to I'm her. Gonna, yeah, okay. entirely. Okay. So you'd only do it if she was cool with it pretty much? Mm -hmm. I mean, that was in the movie theater. Okay. I okay. Mean, well, that's. Appreciate I mean, you. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, obviously uh, we don't can cut through some of this. Um, so, I mean, I want to know because obviously, I mean, you're such a good dude that, I mean, this shit shouldn't be happening to you. You know, I mean, because I, I think, uh, you know, you're very empathetic and I think there's a lot of people that, I think there's a lot of people that just don't really want to give you an ear even at all. I, the wrong ones would. Sure. I mean, is there a, so I got to ask, cause, you know, obviously I know you're not out to hurt anybody, but. I mean, there's some types of people, but. I can't get people to leave anymore, and the ones over there have guns. Yeah, but you're not out to hurt innocent people. No. Oh. Right. So, this stuff with Summer, I mean, it wasn't obviously looking at some Facebook stuff, you know, just pet before Summer and shit that's happened. When did this kind of stuff start for you, man? Like, what do you mean? Like, just kind of, you know, these younger ladies under 18 kind of messaging you online. I don't normally do that, actually. I know it's not a normal thing, but when did it start? Like, how how many how many of uh, these younger ladies have messaged you? Like, there's Summer, and I know there's a few others. How many times did that happen? What do you mean, like, I mean, I haven't really talked to anyone else but her. It's underage in a while. In a while. Uh, so, I told the cops about this, too, because the other motherfuckers are f***ing their kids. Or letting people do for their money. I told Adam Satterfield this, and he tried to just arrest me. Told. What's other? Because obviously it seems like you want to protect them. They keep jumping me every time I try and tell people what their parents are doing. Okay. F man. So, so this other. Because obviously I know you wouldn't let anybody hurt Summer. 
So this other underage, was this online or in person? In person. In person, okay. So was this the 11-year-old? I was in Warner a long time ago. I was up for three days hooking up this one chick and they switched him out. I mean, I'm not saying I didn't like her, but I've realized like I did in the wrong ways after spending a lot of time with her. Okay, so it was I a mean, bonding thing? It took over two years before anything really happened. So okay. I'd, so it started when she was, well, I'm sorry, you started hanging out with her when she was nine. Then when she was 11, that's when uh, y'all had together? Or? Yeah, they switched out. She came back in the hoodie that I was wearing when I sent her over. So which one? Okay. And she, how many years ago did uh, this happen? It, it's almost been two years now. Two years, okay. So you're uh, how old now? I turned 30 on April 29th. Okay, so, so basically, um, you know, as, as harsh as it sounds, I'm not here to judge you, man, but basically you were 28 and this girl was 11 and you'll have to together? They switched them out. I mean, I was, I don't know, I was up for a long time, but I, yeah. Okay. They've, they've, the, the father and the Fisher kept trying to say I could pay to, and I wouldn't. Mm -hmm. And she told me she's tired of getting all the time. She, she, so they were her out? They're doing that to a lot of kids at Trailer Park. I've been screaming oh, about it, man. posting, bitching for years. I've told Baca, Bikers Against Child Abuse. I told Pastor. I've told the Thank police you for chief. That. Thank you. And all the heads keep trying to beat me to death. Hey, man, keep fighting the good fight. Okay. So let, let's make sure that, I mean, because obviously the average person hearing something like that, a 28-year-old having sex with an 11-year-old, they would think the worst things. Luckily, I don't, okay, because you're not a anybody but you know let's let's kind of just make sure that we can separate this situation from the actual what's going on you know what i mean mm -hmm. how many times did she have with you just once once okay i mean we did it a whole bunch when it happened but like how many rounds did y'all go like four was her, she a then okay no i just i don't know she kept like when she came in i just i don't know man she started I don't know. I said, you. I missed you so much that I was hoping you'd say that. Mm -hmm. So then I just, I don't know why, I just like ran up and hugged her. Mm -hmm. And then freaking kissed her and she started sobbing. So they're only letting us do that so they could kill me. And I just told her I didn't care. And you loved her? It's okay. I never really got over it either. Mm -hmm. I've ignored so many. That's the other reason. Like all these other parents tried the same thing. Sending their kids to you? Or telling me I could pay. And they weren't for one and two it's just wrong mm -hmm. i know why well, i keep telling people or they kept smashing my phones because i was trying to record them saying it mm -hmm. so with, with with i mean she does she love you too back you think we it was weird at first you know i mean she's like glare at me and detest me or like i don't know i mean she'd like shake her butt at me or like i could tell she's annoyed by me but then, like, I don't know, we start just talking about things, and I just, I don't know, like, over time, like, it just, it sort of changed. Mm -hmm. I mean, she was more, I don't know, like, we all, everyone Sorry. else is using a bunch of and, like, really mean. Mm -hmm. And, like, all the kids that the offer an RV park are, and they just, I don't know, man, like, everyone in there was higher than shit. And sure, really sure. And we just, I don't know. we Y'all were just kind of the one, the odd ones out in a way? I mean, I was using sometimes, but... I mean, they all are, were, mm -hmm. and I don't know. We just were nice to each other, and no one else was. Mm -hmm. And then anyone else knows us being nice to each other, and they got all mean about it or pissy. Yeah. Or they just assumed that we were hiding, we were doing anything, and we weren't even. Mm -hmm. I mean, I kept trying to tell her grandma or, like, her family. She was, like, shaking her butt at me, and they just, like, thought I was a creep or, like, making it up. Mm -hmm. And, like, I haven't tried to get out of there because, like, I can't, like, I'm going to, like, cave into this or fail, man. I can't. You know, and like someone stole my car, and it's like I don't know. God like kept me there. I I tried. I mm -hmm. tried. And go ahead, keep going. You're good. I mean, I mean, sorry if I'm interrupting you. No, I just I've been. I don't know. That's why I told nurses, like mandatory reporters, Baca, freaking. I told the pastor of my church. Mm -hmm. I gave Adam Satterfield like a 13-page long statement, and then he just tried to go tell me to get the bag man and come back with them and i did well i did i got but i didn't come back with them because like my gut feeling told me not to and they just tried to arrest me and they screamed at me and so he charged me with obstruction because i didn't bring the 
Oh. And he had one of his officers, like, they stole my phone and then even helped me look for it. Mm-hmm. I mean, like, he had me leave my jacket in freaking in one room and I stepped through the other one. Like, they had me going to his garage door and they were, like, all looking out because there's a lives down the street. And then they, I don't know, man. Like, I was in his office, freaking kept my hat. And I went back and my phone was gone. And the oh, officer, like, man. helped me look for it and he yelled at me that I didn't even have it. He told me to f off. Damn. He told me to bring the and come back like I don't know he made a little shh I mean I tried telling him about that for a, quite a while like mm-hmm. it was just more than one kid they tried this with right so I even told you know got I've it been messaging Lynn Hamlin I I told him you know like I mean it's a good thing it took them so long because mm-hmm. I mean I realized after knowing her all that time like I didn't care about her. like I thought it was in the wrong way you mm-hmm. know but I and I found Jesus I was spending all the time. My son changed me. And, you know, if they, when I first moved there, if they tried that shit, I would have failed her, my son, and everyone. Okay. But, I mean, it, you know, like by the time he finally got around to offering me at the man's room, I, I was speechless. I wanted to just them. They were offering you another kid? No, they offered me. They said I just had to pay 150 bucks. For Mm hmm. So they've tried that with four other kids there too. So they tried to offer four other kids to you. What no, happened with two years. what happened with them? I, I don't know. They're his girlfriend's kids. They've got three trailers there, and they he moves between trailers, pushing out of them. Mm-hmm. Freaking! I mean, sometimes I'd go knock on the door, and there'd be like a nine-year-old eyeballs bigger than mine. This is sick. Well, what what happened? Uh, what happened with any of the other kids? I mean, did did they Nothing. like? Well, their parents would scream at me to stay away from them and make a big public scene about it. Uh-huh. And then he would try and sell them to me or he'd like, he put, okay, so like his shower window is like, you know, that smoke glass where you can like kind of see someone's silhouette, but it's like clouded out. Mm-hmm. Freaking, uh, I mean, you can tell there's a little girl in there and he's handed me a bunch of and then he's, and then he was all like, he leans in and whispers, now let him do whatever you want and then tell him it's 250 bucks so we call the cops. And did you have to pay it? Oh, f- no, I didn't even do anything. I just tried to leave yeah did did any of these girls like reveal themselves to you to try to trap you or anything like that no there's another kid here in muskogee though she's only five and they try and have her f- all the guests i would look away every time at just, rays no 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 we're at, at uh okay it's i sent the officer um i sent him an email uh-huh. it's one of the houses down the street from, uh can i show you on maps sure her name is uh a, i Did she, uh, did she, uh, did you have, like, the misfortune of having to see her f- you? No, oh, I'd look away every time she tried to do she it. She tried to do it? Okay. So she would try to do it to you? She would try and f- me, and I'd just look away. Okay. She's, I mean, there's just a certain point that's too little. Right. I mean, that's unspeakable. It's right. It's unforgivable. Right. Let's see. That's where it is, that house? Not this one, it's here in Grand Street View. There's a house across the way from two. I've been trying to tell the cops all this stuff and it's that one right there. This okay. is the house right next to you, but that mm-hmm. one they sell meth out of and I don't know, that's where she stays. But, yeah. I mean, you can tell she's high. She'll come in and, like... Oh, and, God. Like, I mean, yeah, no, I mean, like, I know kids are hyping all over the place, but, I mean, her eyes are, like, you know... The kid. Some... Damn. Okay. I... So, I... Connor, how do you how do you feel about... I mean, do you regret the situation with... Uh, the only thing I regret is I didn't... I mean, I took pictures of us together. It was my idea, too, and not any... Way, but I mean, like, just us holding each other and then kissing. Cause I said no one would believe us. I was gonna try and turn myself in. Cause I just, she told me she's tired of getting all the time, and I told her I had a plan. Oh, did you want to marry her? I did. She okay. was more a mom to my son than anyone else. I, and I know I kind of contradict myself. I don't know. I didn't give up. I just, I. Do you do you have those uh do you have those memories of you and? She would. All right, her like, I feel really bad. So these other 
stole her hoverboard's power supply. I didn't know it, but she actually like let me use the last of its battery just to try and ride it for once or figure it out. She would pull my son's wagon back and forth on her hoverboard to zip around. Like, All that at 11? Wow. Well, she was doing that for about a year. She was more his mom than his son. Or that, that. Than his mom was? Yeah. Got it. I mean, they. no one else like let me near their kids because they were geek or kept stringing my stare. And I mean, I'm not saying I didn't, but... Mm -hmm. do, do you, uh... Do you, uh... I mean... Is there anything you can reminisce on with her? Like, not just memories, but I mean, do you have, like, obviously I know you don't have, but do you have like those photos of her kissing you and you kissing her together? Like, they were on my old, my old Gmails. That's the only reason I sent the cops. Like I told them mm -hmm. that I'd take dry rock or sheet rock and yeah. crush it up with manure and a substation of what the f fill. I didn't want to say anything in the US, but I figured that would get like federal attention or maybe they'd realize like someone was hurting these kids. Or... What, what Gmail do you have the photo of her showing affection to you on? Because can you can you email, maybe I can help with that. Can you email me that photo? I can't, there was like over nine phones ago. Over nine phones ago, in just two years? Yeah, I mean, I accent prone, I broke a couple and people kept stealing them. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, if it's on an old, what Gmail was it on? I... I've got a whole bunch of them. I sent them. Uh, which G which Gmail is it on right now? It, it's not on these ones, but that's why I tried to show them. Like, uh, yeah, maybe you can show me the one it's on. So, I, so like my Gmails, I keep using the same ones. They would steal my phones. Uh -huh. It's on uh, three eight seven. Uh, another one is with three four three. So email this one's 387, the, so is it on that one? No, it's not. Cause I, I don't have access to them anymore. They took my phones. I'd have the. Uh, I'd have the. I'd have the uh, like the two-factor authentication mm -hmm. on there, right? And they just I can't get back in without the phone. I'd wake up. I even called them once on one of my old phones. It was off, mm -hmm. and you obviously didn't even understand why I was complaining or calling him. But I mean, like I called him on a Wi-Fi phone, so didn't have signal. Yeah. And I mean, he's like, "Well, you called us. What, what were you talking about?" I'm like, no, someone stole my phone. They broke in while I was asleep, and my phone's gone. It okay. Was, it was plugged in. It was on an aux cord. And I just came out and it was gone. And they were like, "Well, what, what are you talking about? You called us." I Got like, it. No, I, someone stole it. Got it. And I. But no, like all my email addresses, I kept them the same because I figured there's going to be problems someday. Okay. So, I mean, um, so those those other um, kids, I mean, did did they ever try to kind of come on to you? Okay. What? Yeah, but their parents are freaking crazy. They're like, Joe Herring's fucking crazy ass kept telling me to like, go ahead and do whatever I came here to do. And he just sat there with a freaking chainsaw in his living room. I mean, that's not at all normal. Go do whatever you came here. So this was so in his house. His daughter tried to come on to you. Yeah. Okay. She busted in the bathroom once a couple of times while I was using it. Okay. And but it, I was it, actually like, that's out. So that's what, kind of lucky. Oh, uh, yeah. well, she's into that maybe. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, so uh, what house were you living in? Uh, so you were at Joe's house, and Joe's nine-year-old Joe, daughter tried to come no, on no, to no, you. No, no, no. She was nine. I think I don't know. How old she is. If you had a guess. Maybe 13. So she tried to come but on to you. they kept trying to like tell me I could pay or I had to pay. And then he would go out in the backyard and like say he just needs 160 bucks for freaking his four wheeler and pawn. Uh huh. But I mean, I put two together. I just, I don't know, man. So I, they what? They kept shoveling me from like dope house to dope house and they kept trying to throw their kids at me. And I, Were you trying to get from him or? Yeah, I would get oh. from him all the time. Okay. But they would try and include other things. I, even if I wanted to, I couldn't. That's wrong. Is there ever times you did, did want to? Yeah. Okay. But I hate myself for it more than everyone else does. All but, right. I mean, it sucks are, are, to do, see do you, Are you Christian now? I've oh, been. Been a Christian. Are you more devout now than you were? Okay. So, we're all Christians here, man. Let's let's get it off your chest. Like, maybe, maybe if they never even hear you say this or whatever, Now's the time, you know. If God's walk, God's absolutely listening to this, and He's very forgiving. Jesus is forgiving. You know I, what happened with some other girls, man? It was just it was the only one I ever slept with. She okay. asked me if she was the first one too, and she was. I know, slept with. But what other stuff happened with other girls? I'm not talking about. I'm talking about. I freaking they they just keep trying to offer me different girls, man. Wrong uh, ages or like which ones he's staring at, which ones he into. Or freaking, they just literally like tell me, just like shoot a number and come on, man, you know you want to, or like. No, I, I know, but you don't have the control back then that you do now. I didn't do it. I'm not saying you did anything. It's not because I didn't trust him either. No, I know, but is there anything like maybe just kissing other girls that happened? I wish sometimes. You no. wish, okay. And these were all like between nine and 13? 
some of them were younger, but I never had anything to do with them, like, contact-wise. Okay. I mean, they were abusing everyone else's doing whatever with them, but... So, the, which ones... Okay, so just any type... This is the youngest and first girl I've actually slept with. Okay. She asked me that, and I told her that, and this was the case. Okay, so what other ages um, just had contact with you? Like, 13, 12, 14? Like, just hugging, kissing, stuff like that? There's this girl, she's like 16, somewhere in there. Okay. She was, I don't know, this other girl, I was at a this what, place. What do you all, do? Everything. Slept together? Yeah, anything but like... Huh, okay, well, it's not two guys, right? So. No, no. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. Um, okay, so, so when the other one besides... Um, who were we going to say? There was this one place, what? Which... Like, you, you said, you said... Then somebody else, who was somebody else? Jesus is really proud of you right now, man. Truly. I I sent the officer a bunch of emails. I I was more concerned about the they're being hurt or and her brother. I, they they have freaking gray matter in the roof of their car, man. She is bullied at school. She talked okay. about her parents' punk ass stealing is ruining her life. And she talked else. to you about that stuff. Okay. When did she come to you, like away from everybody? We talked in the living room a couple times right. and out in the backyard. Okay. What happened with you and Nothing. Oh. She busted in the bathroom a couple times, but really No, she wasn't. I mean I was on the toilet though. The okay. dang door won't lock, right? Right. So there was no time she was on the couch, but I just like I was so adorable, I just covered her with a blanket. I know. Hey, look, man. I'm just gonna remind you, Connor. We're not, we're not here to judge you for anything, dude. Okay. And literally everybody here, including yourself, would appreciate it if, you know, because look, it doesn't matter what happened with you. I had nothing did though. They kept trying to proposition her. Uh. -huh. Okay. So, who else had contact with you, like physical contact? So. Or, or, okay. She was the first and youngest girl I've ever slept with. Okay. So the other ones were like 17, 18, 20. Okay. I used to, when I was in Washington, I date older girls to could buy me booze when I couldn't. Okay. So you dated mostly adults. Mm -hmm. Okay. So how do they freaking out go for like I don't know like twenty something? Sure. Or like yeah. Because they were easy to get with, but they were all doing more. <laughs> Than I was. The secret's out, really folks. Mean. Yeah. Okay. Do I get to watch the movie? Oh, yo, we're not holding it here, man, but I think it's important that we talk about this because we could finally get this. Because I know this has been beating down on you, man. I can, I can see it in your eyes that this whole thing with. Uh, even with Summer, it, it, it doesn't. You don't like this, man. You don't like this. I, I don't think you do. I don't, I don't think you like being this way. And that's why I think that help instead of trouble is the best way to go. You know what I mean? So, what happened with any girls between and that were nothing? They, just, everyone kept trying to. Just or those they two. Thought that I was the sword or had this reputation. Okay. So, they all like I can't even tell you how many heads have tried to like push that on me or offer. Mm -hmm. And parents told me that they just put something in their burgers and they were passed out inside. Mm -hmm. Did Chloe ever? So I think. I'm trying to get her last name. Yes, that's who I talked to. I mean, you know, Truth Finder, right? You heard of Truth Finder? It's like, you know, those sites pay 30 bucks a month for and you can find people. They're not hard to find. Um, I, I did talk to. I did, I did talk to her. And what I'm hearing is kind of, it's mostly right, but. You know, there's like, obviously, you know, it wasn't just me and um, keep bringing up and... I'm concerned about her. Parents have gray matter on the roof of their car. I know, using. I know, I know. And that's why, like, you know, she said you were protective of her and all that stuff, but... I tried to be. There's a couple of times I should have just punched her dad or something else, but... I... Yeah, but there was a few times where both of you guys got a little bit carried away. There wasn't with No. No? Okay. 
Was there anybody else you think I talked to that probably said there was? I didn't do anything with her though. I wanted to, but I didn't. I like, my gut feeling told me not to. Like her dad was literally going to kill me. Okay. That's what they do too, man. It's sick. Right. I mean, not. Yeah. I mean, they should. Anyone that forces them, but I mean, they they literally are trying to do that just so they can take people's stuff or make money and free. They do that instead of snitch or like to make. Mm. I, mean, I don't know. You wouldn't believe me. They sell people's organs on the black market. Oh, I know. Have you been on the dark web before? No. No, I find enough trouble as it is. Okay. Um, do you watch any, like, do you get temptations to watch, like, and stuff like that? I mean, I do. But okay. I go into okay. Everything's, like, all electronically, like, like tracked and stuff. Mm -hmm. Anything with a Pentium 4 process. I should fill the cup. Anything with Pentium 4 processor and up, like anything you do, it has some fingerprint, like it's electronically logged everywhere, like everything. Pew, 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 pew. Right, right, right. Like, so, I mean, you're not really getting away with much. Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, you know, obviously looking at this, hearing about, I mean, it seems like some shit you've seen has really got your mind in a place where you probably don't want it to be um, with kind of this, you know, younger than 18 stuff. You know what I mean? So, what, truly, when when did I'm not saying that you don't like adults either. I was just saying when did this stuff with under 18 start for you? Like these feelings. I I don't really know when to say. Has it been since you were like high school or? I don't know. Freaking when I was younger, girls would pick on me or wouldn't really sleep with me. I got bullied and I got when I was little, so I slept with a bunch of guys. I never really got the chicks very much, or they'd make fun of me for my size. So so you think that's. So you think that's like what it is? I, I don't know. Do, do you think like, I mean, now we know why it's good. Anyone who gives me a chance or is nice to me, I'd want to, this is attractive is all. Do you find like younger girls are more understanding of you? I don't know. They actually listen or don't get all, I don't know. Any, I don't know. Man. So more understanding then, pretty I mean, much. They talk to me. They're okay. the only ones that really find me interesting. Okay. Hey man, I can listen to your stories for 24 hours. But after 24 hours, I'd be done. But like, I could listen to it for 24 hours. You probably have a lot to tell. Um, okay, so I mean, now that kind of makes sense. You're not just some, you know, you're not driving the ice cream truck around the elementary school and shit. <laughs> okay, so obviously on Facebook, you know, teen dating groups, you know, yada, 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 yada. When did this Facebook stuff start for you? Kind of reaching out to underage, them kind of reaching out to you? That was the first time ever. Uh, well, I mean, we could kind of go through some shit on Facebook and find that wasn't the first time. Maybe it's the first time someone responded. Was, was that was that the first time someone responded? Yeah, okay. Pretty much. Did you reach out to others? I have a couple of times. Okay. Earlier. And how old were they? I mean, I don't know. Like one was overseas, like fifteen. Mm -hmm. That's one people talk to. Absolutely. What do they talk about with you? Fairies. I... Okay. I'm sorry. I've got a headache now. We're good. It varies, so... in the heat, and I probably need to drink more water. Oh, if you want to get some, get some. Okay. Is that all right? Absolutely. What time is it? It's 9... Oh, we got some time. Oh, 9.55? Yeah. Yeah, we do. 9.13. I'll be right back. You're not going to run off, are you? No. I don't think that's an option, is it? All right. Well, it is, but, I mean, it's not smart. What's up, man? Uh, I still need some water and tea. All right. Feel better? Yeah. All right. So, um, those other, uh, okay. <laughs> You're good. So the, those other uh, girls, you said a 15 year old overseas. Um, so at first, before we get into the various things they talked about with you, how many were there? Was it like 20, 30 or? Just one. One, the 15 year old? I was trying to like, I don't know, talk to one person. Okay. How did, what did she talk to you about? Uh, she asked me to help share her status so she get better, uh, she get better score on her uh, assignment. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, ah, uh, uh, and uh, oh dang, it's been a while. Okay, so how old are all those girls right there? 
Uh, I mean, you can look for yourself. Like, way inbounds. Freaking, uh. May I see it? Just, okay. How old is D uh 27 and married okay oh okay mr home wrecker no i met her boyfriend or fiance a couple times in uh -huh. my house and then i met him in jail okay i used to be home 2.0 though i'd sleep with the chick and then the dude behind each other's backs i'm not even kidding that meant that's hey i've got my ass whooped there's like this this unspoken moment where you do something that the other one did and they just look at you and realize and then just I mean, like, it, there ain't nothing like having dudes. Just... <laughs> yeah. may, may I check your gallery for some stuff? Yeah. Okay. Before getting them, you know, just might as well get it out of the way. Oh, there's your. Sorry. No, I've seen it before. I mean, I'm gonna, before I just scroll here, is there anything you should get rid of that could be, like, illegal? No, okay. All right. Is there any situation on Facebook where um, where anybody's like sent you images, like even the 15 year old that you weren't supposed to have or mm -hmm. nobody's like spammed you with anything before that you didn't want to see? No. No, okay. Have you come across like any type of images of younger ladies under 18 ever? I mean, years ago. I don't save them though. Yeah, w w where was that? Where did that happen? Washington, Pennsylvania, just searching the internet or weird freaking uh, websites. Okay, how many years ago was this? Uh, about like over five or mm -hmm. six. So I've how? Been here for a while now. How young do these pictures go? Like I, I don't know. I mean, you just tell it's kind of out of bounds. It's like where? Oh, go ahead. I'm sure they're 4 chan. I quit using years ago, though. Okay. Were they like, were they like infants, toddlers? Oh. Or like, okay. Okay. So like they were like, you think maybe like eight and up, maybe, or what do you think? Like if you had a guess, I don't know. I'm just asking you. End up. What and up? End up. Eight and up. Yeah. If there's anything too sick. Uh, one of my friends is a moderator, and we get the IP addresses posts off of, and we use HiveMind LOAC to DOS them into the fucking ground. Okay. I'd use a UDP data request because it takes, it makes a bigger data packet, so it really is like you. So if you saw stuff that was eight and up, what was too sick? Anything with tears, or I mean, just anything that doesn't, it just didn't look natural or right, or I mean. So would people post like little girls getting shit like that? Yeah. Okay. And that's what was, y'all had to like DDoS that guy? Okay. So, uh, so the, the, so the, was this kind of like a server for child, but you didn't want no, it to get too harsh or? To friggin', it's supposed to be like, oh, it's supposed to be an image board, like for everyone. Okay. But it's like, I mean, it's like Android. It's open source. So yeah. it's like anyone can allegedly post anything. Yeah. But I mean, there's my. It just but, but my thing is why was some child removed but not others i i couldn't even tell you some of it like they've got they've got like over 50 pages on the main gallery they've of got, child no no God, oh okay, no. okay. they've got uh, they've got subdivisions like they've got a certain board for like i mean reddit fans they've got boards for like random stuff i mean like r9k it's supposed to be like uh, it's a weird board like you're only allowed to post the same image or topic once so there's no repeats or spam and spam mm -hmm. i mean there's all kinds of craziness i mean there's just i mean it's supposed to be literally for everything but i mean yeah. they, that's kind of like a, it's a you or against the it's a no but i mean people still do it or get away with it or there's so much posted like you have to be like boom 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 okay got it so some of the images that you came across that were like eight and up i mean you said you didn't save them i mean did you did you indulge in them a little bit too much I, sometimes I'm not your judge. I mean, I, I mean, I scrolled through them. I didn't, but I mean, were these videos and pictures, or just videos, just or pictures. just pictures? They would also have like links to websites, which we'd forward on to the next guy or freaking DOS. Okay. We'd use Hive Mind LOIC, and it put like it would uh, 
it back door into their computers so we could jack their computer and make it do the same thing for us you don't get caught as easily and it uses more data again more machines just bam destroying their server he eats up bandwidth it costs them money mm -hmm. and it can damage their servers actually what was on that's awesome what, what was on some of the websites i it's not even it it was like not safe for soul or just scarring or up so we felt pretty comfortable taking the risk of getting caught doing it was there like like what was the worst thing you saw on those websites anything for like was there a film of children i've heard stories i never found any I okay just, i've seen i've seen stuff that where they didn't look comfortable at all and that's inexcusable how young did those girls go i and those that didn't look comfortable if you had to guess like was it they were just barely above that like so like probably five and six year olds okay that was years and years ago but okay. it was pretty sickening yeah not my cup of tea at all okay when you were looking at you know stuff with the underage what was your cup of tea um if you had i mean just honestly what was it i mean I just teenagers teenagers like age range this to age range that what what age ranges like 13 19 okay and just videos of those ages I mean, yeah okay all right do they have fried pickles in that uh movie theater i don't know i saw popcorn i was kind of considering that it's spendy though check what they have uh, popcorn's more expensive than like fajita at this point everything's expensive these days yeah you ever heard jamie johnson high cost of living ain't nothing like the cost of living high i always used to be singing or rhyming a lot everybody kept telling me to knock to try to stop this acting stuff and it just i don't know man i was trying to just be me or like i don't know it's, just, it's really weird to have someone actually want to sing yeah or sing have me sing to them what's your favorite what's your favorite band i used oh it used to be breaking benjamin I, was them. I mean like i don't know i used to listen to a bunch of stuff my dad i didn't like it at first but uh -huh. I, did. I don't know i oh and i got just edm music because everybody wanted to be like friends with the dj or i could get that way mm -hmm. or i mean i don't know it's a good way to talk to people yeah and i just i mean i know i was never lonely but then like i realized as i never is there anything that people were just gone? Uh -huh. Or I... I don't know. Well, my favorite ba Breaking Benjamin song is uh, probably Dance with the Devil. And yeah, uh, I'm going to act good. it out right now. Let's do that together. Wait. Say goodbye as we dance with the devil. Oh, no, not we. I'm just dancing with him right no. now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't. I dance with Jesus. Yeah, no. Oh, well, all right. Well, um, no, no, I'm... I'm I'm anti-satanic as possible. It's kind of why I do this, actually. Um, you know, kind of ties into it. Um, but uh, yeah, well, let me uh, let me just walk around, and stretch real quick. What is your favorite candy? Reese's Pieces, but I have to watch it. Or Boston baked beans. They my teeth up. Boston right. baked beans. I've uh -huh. never heard of that. It's a peanut thing. Okay. It's got a hard shell on it. Uh huh. It's pretty good. Nice. Dude, where the hell is Pablo? Where did uh, where did our friend go? I guess vaping's better than but Yeah, I don't know. If that's my yeah. So how do, how do you like it at a raise? It, I mean, it's okay, except, I don't know, people keep hitting me or it's breaking my stuff. Really? I, I hear horrible stuff at night sometimes. Yeah, like what? I mean, like shots. At raise? Yeah. They like guns in there? It's not supposed to. Oh, so a free zone doesn't work. Okay. I mean, interesting. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I... Oh shit, you got recordings. Mm -hmm. You're like a little ghost hunter. Yeah, I wish. That was all. You, know, you have to listen. It's just horrifying, though. And it, I, it'll wake me up at night, and it keeps happening. Mm -hmm. So see, you don't sleep too comfortable out. there? Do you, have any, do you have any roommates there? Yeah, they've got a full door. When do you get out of the halfway house? I, I don't know, man. I, I have just another two negative UAs, I think. What's a UA? You're in analysis. Two more. So how often do you take those? Uh, there's, 
I don't know. I have one tonight since I'm going on since I'm going pass. Uh -huh. But it, then they uh, it just it varies. Okay. I mean, they do them at random or like anytime they have suspicion, etc. So once you get two more, you once you pass two more, you're you're out. I think. Nice. Well, that's awesome, man. How many have you passed so far in a row? Four. This is the first time I made it. Really? Mm -hmm. Congrats. So, how do you fall back? Like, so do you get into the halfway house somehow? I, I think. I mean, it's everywhere. Yeah. Right? Are you from here originally, or from Washington, no, or Washington? Washington? State. Where in Washington? Uh, Seattle. Oh. Yeah. That explains the. Uh, the colorful jacket, I'd say. Yeah. What's Paula doing? The lights are on. I'm starving, dude. Is there what's your, is there any like what's your favorite place to eat here in Muskogee? Oh shoot! Uh, I used to really like Panda Express in Washington, but I don't know if they're okay. still. And then uh, <laughs> I don't know. They've got Taco Hell. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't really get it out much. All right. Yeah. I mean, you're telling me the places I can go eat at in my hometown. I mean, I was just you know, I'm not asking you that question again. You're useful for other things, not for food recommendations. Panda Express in Seattle? Oh yeah. They got the Starbucks. Yeah. I'm a. Ugh. I guess that's why chains are chains. Huh. Looks like the pickles are, uh, whatever. Right. Where, where do you like living better here in Washington? You know, I mean, I I can't just walk down the street smoking it here, so. Yeah, huh? it's true. I don't know. I asked myself that, but I've moved here because of family first. You have family here? Mm hmm. Cross living the second. My mom lives okay. here. Huh. How's it going? Good man. So your partner, yeah, your partner over there, uh, he he kind of informed me about what was going on. Yeah, like we're just talking. You're not gonna send a dick pic to a 13 year old again, are you? That's your only time doing that from now on. And you're not gonna have sex with a real 11 year old again. That was your only time doing that. That was the only time, and I tried to tell Adam Satterfield. They've been trying to sell them to these, okay. these kids. Okay. buddy, can you, you mind just standing up for me in the light real quick? I, and just. Since I'm coming in contact, you got any knives on you? No. Any guns? No. Will you lift your waist? Uh, lift your shirt up to your waistband. Don't, don't, don't. Drop it down. Set it to your waist. Lift it back up to your waist. Okay. Turn around for me. All right. Yep. You know, you're not under arrest, buddy. Stop. Let's do it. Sorry. Yes. No, you're good. Transfer. I'm just making sure you got no pocket knives or anything like that no, on you. No, no, okay. I wouldn't. It's just a Terry search. That's all, man. Uh, Terry pad down. Nothing like that. Oh, I've got um, box blade replacements in my wallet. They're magnetic. Okay, well, they're, in their, those? they're in your wallet. What's your, what's his name? What's your name? Connor. You have an ID on you? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, I've got box blades in here, but here. Uh, okay. Just okay. hand me your wallet. Hand me your entire wallet. Thank you. Yes. And Connor, you're not going to try to have digital s with a 13 year old in a movie theater ever again, are you? This is the only time it was going to happen? I, I mean, yeah. Okay, I, all right. Just, got it, got it. I mean, it took months and months. To for sure, for sure. I don't really have excuses. Is that the only box blade you got in here, There's Malin? two in there. When, huh? I'm, when I'm cutting the tarp at work, it's Where's your idea? Yeah. It's Mind in the front of it. Mind front. if I grab it? Yeah, go for it. It's on the very front, no, like other side of the wallet. I don't know why I opened that. Right. That my son gave me that for Christmas. It, Where's your ID at, man? It's at the front of the wall. Close it and look at the other side. Other All he likes about a place is that he can smoke down this room. You know how yeah, hard it was to get that this old mug. Okay. Oh, <laughs> 
Alright, let's hear a call as well, Negative. 543, go ahead. In Nora, 084 167 621. I'm just going to place that one. It's got a lot of sharp objects on it. When I get done, you can pick it up. Okay. So, from what I'm gathering, your partner over there, he's, he told us, is that he has not made contact with an underage person tonight. Right. Okay. Got it. That was a plan tonight. Um, but, yeah, we were once posing as said underage. But, yeah, I mean, you said you said it was the only underage kid you had sex with. They pulled a switcheroo while we were, well, I've been up for days and days, and I switched out with her. She came back in the... Has this per has this person reported anything? The person? Yeah, I gave Adam Satterfield statements about this in Warner. And, oh, so this happened in Five Warner. Three, yeah. Someone I just checked. He's valid and negative. Clear. Thank you. Okay. So it didn't even happen here in. No. Okay. I let the police chief Adam Satterfield know. I gave him a 13-page statement. I, I told Bacher, uh, Bacher, yeah, like I can't child right. abuse. I told my pastor because okay. I knew he's a mandatory reporter. Oh, I told oh, nurses because oh. they're mandatory reporters. Oh, oh, oh. This is the first time I've ever done something like this, so forgive us, we're trying to figure out what we can and cannot do. Of course. And I don't want to misspeak on anything. Let me just start with getting both y'all's information. Okay. What's, uh, uh, what's your name? Alex, A-L-E-X. Last name is R-O-S-E-N. R-O-S-E-N? Yep. What's your date of birth name? What's a good phone number for you? Is that area code? Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Yep. Okay. And your name, buddy? Oh. Texas, brother, huh? I'm from yeah. Texas, too. Where at? Uh, Fort Worth. Okay. Yeah, we're from Houston. So since the alleged crime that he's talking about has already been happened in Warner, it's already been looks like taken care of through being taken care of through Warner. I'm not, and this is just me speaking freely, and I'm not saying that this is correct. We're checking on everything, laws and everything like that. I'm not exactly for sure if we can actually charge this guy with anything tonight because he didn't do anything. Like I understand the intentions. Mm -hmm of what he was supposedly, you know, the keyword supposedly about to do, but there's nothing, he didn't meet an underage girl, he didn't have relations with an underage girl, he just, you know, got caught up in this mess. Which, I mean, I'm not saying it's, it's not right. Yeah, I mean, in Oklahoma City, I mean, we have multiple people arrested and convicted there for doing this exact thing, so. Gotcha. Well, like I said, I got two lieutenants on it, and they're, they're trying to figure it out, so. All right. Is your phone real quick? Oh, shit. Can I see yours? Do you have your phone? Okay. Oh, cool. And what's your phone number, buddy? Hey, sir, do you think I can show you this real quick? Yeah. So this was in Oklahoma City, so, I mean, this he, he got charged with like the same thing, like solicitation, and he had like child too. I don't think he does, but he got charged with solicitation. So like, as long as the law in Oklahoma is, as long as they believe that they're meeting a minor, it doesn't have to be a cop or a kid, as long as they believe it's to be a minor. He admitted on camera he wanted to have sex with this girl and to like marry her and shit. So like, yeah, we're, Set up a sting operation, mm -hmm. facilitating contact with a minor. So I'm, I'm listening to you, all lieutenants. The ones. Clock 40, clock 40, 308. Good. I'm over here at the far west side. All right, so I'm muted. 
Yeah, totally. like we've had people arrested in Oklahoma City for facilitating sexual contact with a minor, which I believe is like solicitation or whatever. And then obviously in Texas, like where we're from, I mean, as long as they believe they're talking to a minor, like we have people convicted for that here and in Texas, so. I got you, I got you. I'm not saying you're, I'm not saying you're yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just saying we've never, I've never personally. Yeah, no, no, no understandable, much. understandable. Um, and I know Texas law is completely different than Oklahoma right. state law. Right, right. Do you have all that information, all that video and stuff on your phone? Yeah, no, it's like right here. On that. How, yeah. how am I supposed to, if, if something, if we are able to do something tonight? Oh, we to email it like as soon as possible. Okay, so if I get, I'm gonna give you my email. Address. For sure. So basically what we got is... Is it unmuted? Screen record the part where, we're talking about the movie theater on the phone. Screen record that part so I can show it to them. Buddy, uh, yeah. I'm gonna need your phone right now. Okay, man. All right. We are gonna seize it for at this moment for evidence purposes. All right. Do you have any other? Go ahead and stand up for me. Go go in the light for me. Just put your hands on that wall. I'm gonna just check you. You got any other phone devices on you, man? Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything in there that's kind of focused? Where's Pablo at? Bro. Uh, sir, have you ever dealt with something like this before? Mm -hmm. okay. That's what I'm saying. Wait on, we'll, once Brandon gets over here and gets briefed on that side, we'll, okay. we'll uh, put it together and figure out exactly what we're going to do. Got it. I would probably go ahead and just detain him, though, and put him in your car. Okay. Go okay. Ahead and just, uh, go ahead and just lay that down for me. Yes. Let's go. Join up locals, Gage. Now is my time to ask. Yeah, sir. We've had uh, we've had people arrested at OKC tons of times yep. for like facilitating people with a minor, or whatever. Right, so this is uh, at the very least we we'll have, we'll have the charge of looter and decent proposals. Okay, tax. appreciate it. Yeah, he admitted everything on camera too, including to like having sex with like two other uh, real underage kids. That's so what the other guy was telling me. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, I'm I'm not trying to encroach on what you guys are doing, but mm -hmm. I would highly recommend if y'all are going to come to any any city. Uh, and you have this stuff going on at least let us know okay for sure so we can be we know we're in the loop and you can work with our investigations division on, okay on getting this stuff done mm -hmm. and in any other cities they'll have detectives and stuff but we have investigators got it uh, so they can work with you on getting this stuff done get everything settled before beforehand may even be able to get a warrant for his arrest beforehand mm -hmm. uh, and get that stuff settled and then sting it and, and get it you know, i mean i think we have probable cause to arrest him right now. for sure More than likely, so. for sure yeah. Yeah, I made sure he like admitted on body on his body cam that he sent a dick pic to to the who he thought.
Yeah.